I'm Mark Bloom. I'm a defender for the Silverbacks, and you're watching SBTV. Okay, Richie, so I have to ask you a couple questions. Who is the laziest person on your team? By far, I would have to say Nani Barrera is the laziest person. He, he, he's on the ball all the time, but then, you know, when he's not on the ball defensively, he just walks in. Okay, and then earlier, I think I remember you saying that there's also the sleepiest person on the team. Can you tell me who that is? Yeah, this person is just has mental breakdowns. <laughs> Beto Navarro, which is in and out. Never, never concentrated. He just one time he's off, and then the next thing you know, he's like looking at the score. <laughs> but he scores goals, right? He does score he goals, scores. so I'll give it to him. Yeah. Okay, good one. Yeah. Um, and can you tell me who has the worst taste in music? I would say probably Pablo. You know, he's a Hispanic little guy and listens to a bunch of rap. Okay. And um, if you got a hold of someone's iPod, who do you think would be the most embarrassed if they stole their iPod and they figured out what his music they listen to? Mentally, I feel like he'd have like in sync or Backstreet Boys or something. Okay. And who do you think from your team would be the most likely to audition for American Idol? Um. Probably Manzanelli. I feel like he's always doing some out of this world stuff, just showing off somehow. Okay. And to be considerate of the guys, can you tell me who the most intelligent member of the team is? Uh, I would say the most ready and planner would be Mark Bloom. He's always on top of me. Very good. Kudos to Mark. And thank you so much for your time, and I look forward to interviewing you again. Thank you. So I've heard rumors mm -hmm. that you are the sleepiest person on the team. And to save face, what do you think about that? Are you the person that sleeps the most on the team? Not, not the sleepiest. I would say every now and then on the field, I do yeah, lose focus every now and then. But that's because I'm, I'm thinking a step ahead. I'm already thinking of the next thing to do. So I think they, they take it the wrong way. But I would say I do have little brain parts every now and then. Right? <laughs> It's very eloquent, mm -hmm. and and to to your to your namesake, you do score goals. So even though you are thinking about the stars, you, you do play well. So right, right. right. I, th I think I, I do deserve a bit more credit in that aspect, I guess. But <laughs> <laughs> you know, at, at the end of the team, when the team wins, that's all that matters. To me. Okay, and let's see. So I also heard that you take a long time to get your hair ready, <laughs> right? So who else do you think oh, takes the no, longest no, to get ready? Hmm. I would have to say, who can that be? Besides you. Maybe Mark. <laughs> I, would, I would say uh, Mark Withers. Mark Withers has been, uh, he's been on right to practice, but sometimes we have to wait up there 10 minutes maybe to wait for him. Either it's, he's making his breakfast late, or he's doing his hair as well, or something's always up. So I would say Mark Withers. And speaking of food, who eats the most on the team? Who's always eating? Who eats the most? Oh man, I'm gonna have to put Ruben Luna on blast. He, he loves to eat, he loves to eat the crazy. Alright Danny, so the world wants to know, who is the clown on the team? Who's the funniest guy? Um, definitely has to be Pablo Cruz. Um, he's always in the locker room, messing around with people taking their clothes, making fun of them. Uh, and he's also the one that likes rap music, right? Yeah, I mean, his taste in music's not too bad. Everyone has different tastes. For me personally, the worst taste in music is Richie. He, uh, he I mean, if you look through his iPod, it's like a techno concert and <laughs> house concert. Uh, so Pablo isn't too bad. I mean, he is the most jokester, always messing around. But uh, the worst music is Richie, for sure. And out of the guys, who do you think would be the best dancer? Um, I think uh, Milton would be a good dancer, Milton Blanco. He uh, he has rhythm. You can tell he has rhythm even in little soccer drills that we do. And uh, I assume he's probably a good dancer. All right.